everybody, this is Dave. Uh, somebody last night uh, on uh, Johnny's radio show, Day Trading Radio, somebody asked me about how to put pivots on a TOS chart. So uh, I'm going to show you right quick how to do that. Uh, what you're looking at is, is a chart of the ES. You, you just go right up here in this little window and you type in slash ES. And that brings up your ES chart. Now I've got a one day, 15 minute chart showing. That's what you're looking at. Uh, this right here was, uh, that would be yesterday, which was Wednesday. And this is today. Now this chart's live, so you may see this candle right here moving. Uh, but to add pivots, uh, now, I, I'm going to show you two different ways because I've already got the pivots saved in my studies and you can do that and it's real convenient. You go up here to studies, load study set, and I've named mine pivots daily. And all I got to do is click it and bam, there's my pivots. That's my daily pivot. Uh, this is support one and two. This is resistance one and two, and I don't plot anything after that. But I'm going to show you how to set that up. So let's take the pivots off. Uh, let's remove them. Hit OK. And you can see there's no pivots there. So here's how you add your pivots. You go to Studies, uh, Edit Studies. That brings up this. Wait a minute, I'm going to have to move this one down here where you can see it. Okay. That brings up this uh, Edit Studies and Strategies window. Scroll down till you find Pivots. Okay, it's actually labeled Pivot Points. You select that. You go right here and click Add Study. And what that'll do, that'll shift it over here into this column. Uh, let me tighten this window up. Well, I can't. Okay. I just want to make sure you can see everything I'm doing here. Now, we've, we've selected pivot points from over here, added it, and now we've got them here. Now we're going to plot them or, or set our uh, preferences. Uh, show only today, no. That means it'll show yesterday and today. Time frame is a day. And from here you can select day or week. We want the daily pivot. Uh, we're going to go down here to R3. And show plot. Show bubble. I'm going to uncheck that. So they don't show up. R2. Show plot. Show bubble. That means they will show up on the chart. Same thing with R1. And notice the color right here. You, you can change the color. You can change the uh, line style, how wide you want it. Uh, okay, next is pivot. I always use this color right here as a pivot. That's kind of a standard pivot color, and I'm just so used to looking at it. Uh, I'll go up here and make sure. Show plot, show bubbles, check. Same thing for S1. I use green. S2, show plot, pivot, uh, show bubble. And S3. Uh, don't show the plot, don't show the bubble. So now, all you got to do is hit apply, OK, and bam, there they are. There's your pivots. So it's really that simple. Um, now, what you can do, so you won't have to go through that over time, is when you're in here in your studies, and I've got pivot points right here, you select it. Go right here to save set and then just type in a name that you want to save those pivot sales. And like I said, I've already got, as you can see, I've got pivots, comma, daily. That's how I save mine. So you just type in whatever name you want to save it as. Um, and then after there, you can just go to uh, studies. Load study set, select that, and it'll pop them in there for you. Hey, y'all have a good day. I hope everybody makes a buttload of money today, and I will talk to you later.